it is my pleasure to present to you our nominee and the next <laughs> member of Congress from Virginia's 2nd Congressional District, the <laughs> great leader and fighter, Jim Gas prices that are nearing five dollars a gallon. 
Joe Biden pushed through trillions in spending while downplaying the risk of inflation. And now inflation is higher now than at any time in the last 40 years, and families are struggling to put food on the table and to keep up with basic expenses. Our older adults and our veterans are living on fixed incomes and being devastated by inflation. We must restore America's economic strength, and I will fight to bring prices down by ending Joe Biden's reckless spending and holding government accountable. Joe Biden and the Democrats have also made, made us less safe at home and abroad. <laughs> Any work polls for you? We face, we face threats at home, skyrocketing, skyrocketing crime and drug overdoses, and Joe Biden's weakness has created a border crisis that affects every American, even those who don't live on the border. Joe Biden's weakness has also created threats from abroad. His incompetent retreat from Afghanistan cost the lives of 13 servicemen and women and was an embarrassment for our country. We abandon our allies and we, we even abandon our own citizens behind them in enemy lines and Russia was watching. I will fight to restore America's strength by supporting our military because a strong America is a safe America and a safe world. Every one of Joe Biden's disastrous policies are on the ballot this November. And in the second district, these policies go by the name of Elaine Larea. Yeah. 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 Get her a new job, Jen. By $5 a gallon gasoline to runaway inflation to an open border to Afghanistan and the Ukraine, Elaine Larea has been Joe Biden's chief enabler. She voted for Joe Biden's failed agenda more than 98% of the time, and she's voted to make Nancy Pelosi speaker of the House not once, but twice. Election day, though, okay, there's a have some hope. There's hope. <laughs> Election day is 140 short days away, and I can't wait to work with you all to restore American strength and come together on November 8th, back here, hopefully, to celebrate another election yeah. day. First and foremost, I have got to thank my campaign staff. And those guys are yeah. yeah. and, Tyler, and Tyler works for our Senate side and campaign side. So. And then Joe Link has absolutely crushed our ground game. Yeah, Joe!
why does Jen why is Jen Kagan a rhino? A rhino? Why does she why is she pro choice? Why is she anti police? Why does she vote with the Democrat? I mean the insanity that don't, has don't existed in the past. It's ridiculous. Don't don't repeat repeat any of it's ridiculous. But you guys have had my back every single time. Absolutely. So thank you very much for having me back. listen to my answers. I really appreciate you looking for the truth that is in politics. That's one reason I ran in 2019, because I couldn't stand the division and the rhetoric and the way we did politics. It's wrong. It's wrong what happened the past couple weeks, but we're super excited to run a positive campaign. We're super excited yeah. to take this yeah. so I look forward to having you all on my team going into the general election, and most of all, I look forward to being your next congresswoman from the 2nd Congressional District. God bless all of you. God bless our great Commonwealth, and God bless our great, great country. Yes, you yeah.